but most people are allergic to the lactose, which oh, are the dairy sugar. There's something really, something strange going on around here. Whenever I eat fat, I lose fat. That's really weird. I gotta figure this out. Ugh. morning everyone hey good morning good morning welcome to all the new folks and welcome back everybody oh you guys this is tomorrow is our last and final day of the carnivore challenge for everybody um yesterday harry and i added eggs back to my elimination diet you guys um, we had a really nice day. We had ground beef and eggs and we went on a ride and we just really enjoyed ourselves yesterday. Anyway, everything that you guys eat the day before and sometimes two days prior can have a direct effect on your weight. It can cause water weight gain or it can cause water loss. So I'm going to share with you because I did add eggs and I'm going to add eggs only back to my diet for three days. So yesterday, today's it's day two, tomorrow's day three. After that, after I see how I do with eggs, I'm gonna add back dairy. Now, dairy is a big category because there's, if the, most people are allergic to the lactose, which are the dairy sugars, which are the sugars in dairy products. Some have more than others. There's more lactose in, um, you know, and as you get a carb or two, that has more lactose in it. So we need to see and figure out if, if it's causing an issue for me. We need to see how eggs do for me yesterday, today, and tomorrow. So with that, let me share you guys what we had yesterday. So yesterday, we had an 18 hour fast. I had six ounces and Harry had six ounces of ground beef and we each had two eggs on top. It was yummy. We cooked the eggs in a tablespoon of beef tallow and I don't know why but they tend to stick but they were absolutely delicious. You guys, we cooked some of that chuck steak that I got at Bash's on sale because I don't remember having chuck steak except as a kid. Harry and I as adults have never bought any. It was absolutely delicious, wasn't it, Harry? Mm -hmm. It was tender. It was really good because I hear that chuck steak is a um, less expensive cut of meat and it can be tough. Well, it was yummy. It was absolutely delicious. I had 10 ounces of the chuck steak. Harry had 11 ounces of the chuck steak. And it was fantastic and we ate the whole darn thing. We each had two scoops of collagen throughout the day with stevia in black coffee, and Harry had Bang, Zevia, and Stevia as well. And a Diet Coke. Oh, that's right, we went through um, McDonald's and got mom a little fish sandwich, and I had a nasty ass glass of unsweetened iced tea, which I took a couple sips of, and I don't know what they made it with, but it was nasty, and I didn't drink it, but Harry had a diet. I don't know if they're Pepsi products or Coke Well, I products. think that blew it for me today. What else blew it? I came, okay, we went to bed at 10 o'clock last night and I'm going, where is Harry? I'm sitting in there, Sally's in there, we're all waiting, right? So I come, Harry, and you know, I'm looking for him. And he's like, what? He's like, what? I'm, a, I'm in the bathroom. And I'm like, what are you eating? Well, I'm going to the bathroom. Right? I stand outside the bathroom, I hear crunching. He had a glass of water and pork rinds in there and he was eating them. Right now. Right. Pork rinds and how many? Handful. Like, oh, I had maybe a quarter, handful. quarter of an ounce. You guys just, just incorrigible he's naughty. Look, okay, new board, new board. Come over here, come over here. He did not fast. 
He had pork rinds. I almost forgot. See, and you weren't going to... You weren't going to say a thing. You were just going to let me just go la 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 down the, down the board. You were not I brought up the Coke. Well, that's... People drink Diet Coke all the time and Pepsi. I just am not one that can drink it. But the pork rinds are important. Number one, you ate them at 10 p.m. at night. And you went right to bed. So you had them on a... You know... And then... You fibbed to me. No, I never fibbed. <laughs> you omitted the fact that in the bathroom you were eating pork rinds. I said, what? You went... And you said, are you eating? I go, what do you mean eating? <laughs> but you sat, you had a mouthful of pork rinds at the same time. I could tell. Oh, you're not. And you had the door shut. Well, I was going to the bathroom. The <laughs> anyway, folks, enough of that. He was naughty. He had them. He didn't fast. I did. Busted. Busted. Okay. Zero carbs. None. Not a zero zilch. 59% of our calories came from fat. 88 grams of fat. 41% came from protein for 135 grams. The total calories were uh, 1,365. We're trying to stay under 14 on the car carnivore elimination diet. So we've cut back on the steak because we did overindulge. So the weird thing is neither one of us lost yeah, or this gained. Is, this surprised me. Yeah, I am amazed. I thought I was going to go down at least two tenths of a pound. Well, you don't think pork rinds at 10 p.m. and then going to bed with that in your stomach didn't make a difference? Hey, possible. I thought I would go down. But actually, we were driving, not walking yesterday. We did go to. I got like a little, little bit of heat bit. stroke yesterday. Yeah, you had to sit in the car with my mom and Sally while I ran in and grabbed some more stuff for mom and for us. I did as fast as I could too. That bashes. I got. We had to get mom dizzy. Some. I had a upset stomach. Yeah. The whole bit. We came home, both of us, and took electrolytes because. It was hecka hot, you guys. It was 114 outside the car. And they were inside the car with the car windows rolled down while I ran into bashes. Anyway, you guys, seriously. Um, so we, I did good on eggs yesterday. Let's see if I do eggs and ground beef good today. Anyway, folks, let's go to the big board because I need to get to work today. And I need to get to my emails. So let's check this out. Here well, we here. pretty much went over it all already. We already know that... This all this is really forced for us to have data you on. You didn't put our weight on uh, what we've done. Yeah, you need to put our weight down there. Change your places, because you're left-handed. You know what they say about left-handed people? What? Not We're, much. Shut up! You're so mean. I have some lefties <laughs> on there. <laughs> you guys, mm. anybody who's left-handed, let me know. Give us a mm. shout out. That's an eight. I know. I'm sorry because I'm left-handed. Well, first of all, you use the wrong color for the for the for that, and you just you. Harry will redo it. Yes, he will. He will. There, zero and zero. That anyway. is really weird, though. So, if you look here, you guys, from here to here, I've lost a pound total from when I started. Harry, he broke his. He went 78. So I've lost. I've lost one. You've gained, no, you've lost almost three pounds. Yeah, almost three pounds. Wow, that's exciting. So you know, I've got to put that over gained, here. Yeah. It's got to go over here. Okay, well, why don't you do this, Harry? We'll go ahead and let you clean the board up, finish the board, and I'll go ahead and get started with my day. When we come back to break fast, we'll show them the board, and we'll explain Monday and all that good stuff, because okay. I have to get going. I have training today. Okay, bye. Bye. See you guys in a little bit. Okay, Harry, I want you to talk about your big board because you're the master of the big board. I'll trade you places. Master of boredom. Master of the board. Okay, where would you like to start, sir? Class. Okay, so you know, this is what we've been doing for a month and you all have been following along, at least a lot of you have, and uh, what it's kind of proven to us because we didn't really lose any weight. If you look over here, let me get to it. We really didn't, for the first three weeks, we, sure it. for the first three weeks, we really didn't lose any weight. We lost, Wendy lost a pound, but then she went back up. 
um, you know, you can see where she, I mean, she lost six tenths of a pound, then she gained a pound, then she gained two pounds, and now she's gone down a pound from the beginning because she had to lose all of this to get back to that. Same thing up here. I did a little bit better than she did. She went down a pound totally. I went down three as of this being the fourth week. So if you look at week one, right? Yep. And this is week four or the last, second to the last day. Yeah. Tomorrow's the final day. Tomorrow's the final day. <clears throat> but I think I'm going to probably continue on with this because now that I've started to grasp how this works better, I have found out that fat makes you lose fat, basically. Right. For us. For us. Now, that doesn't mean it will work for everybody, but for some oh, reason, this it's is... working for both Wendy and I. We have a skillet emergency. There must have been some oil on the bottom of the pan, yeah. and it was smoking, and I went, uh oh, I don't want our alarm to go off. Anyway, you guys, we're going to break our fast, and thank you, Harry, very much for the board. Um, it's shown us a lot of stuff. Th thank you for letting me be here today. Yes. Come on, Mr. Cameraman. I don't know why that's making a weird noise. Because it's hot? Everything's weird. Get that to burn off. Even the people in the house are weird, honey. Yes, we okay. are. Anyway, you guys, so here's the deal. We're going to have two eggs and six ounces of ground hamburger, which Harry was kind enough to cook. We're going to have our grass-fed eggs as soon as the oil gets burnt off. So let me do that real quick. Hopefully it's burnt off. I put a big, a generous portion of tallow in there. Tallow in there. Did you put it on? I don't know. We'll see. For some reason, you guys, I don't understand Maybe why. You try one of the um, gold pipe pans. See what happens. One of the just the stainless steel. Stainless steel pans. Well, happens. I wish I could get Mom's um, iron skillet that I grew up with because she doesn't cook anymore. Maybe I should ask her for it. Hey, okay, you guys. So here's the deal. We're gonna have. And I apologize for the noise, but I had to get that smell. I don't want my smoke detector to go crazy. Uh, we've got six ounces of ground beef, and we're each having two eggs, and we'll come back when it's all plated, and it's breakfast, but it's going to be about 10.30 today because I'm hungry, and I want my eggs. So we'll see everybody in a little bit. We'll share what we have when we break fast, and I get it all plated. You screw up? Or do I screw up? Look at this, they're sticking again. Well, you know, it's that pan. That pan is really old and needs to be replaced. It's, it's not an old pan. We've only had pan. it since we bought our induction. Ooh. Now let me get some hamburger. We gotta weigh the hamburger. Lost. Lost in America look. Wendy gets the deer in the headlight look. A lot. I do. I do. It's like, where am I? What do I need? Remember, um, eggs have a one-to-one -one fat to protein ratio. Oh. Now, how could I forget? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I want my want egg on top. Egg on yes, top, don't you? Not. Yes, definitely want the egg on top. The sauciness. Ooh, mm -hmm, look at that sauce. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's what we're talking about. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's what we're okay, talking about. Okay, let me about. put this oh, one. Yeah. yeah. Let me do this. Zero that out. If you want some tallow, I'll give you some. I no, don't have a problem think, with that. If you think we're doing I'm it. I'm going to go. We used to log everything. I'm not a logger. I'm, 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 not, I'm not a logger. I don't... Well, you know, if you're not, then I'm why a, are you asking me these more things? More of a pioneer. Because it's a moot point. If you don't know what your your macros well, are, well, you're supposed to know this say? stuff. Uh, right. Uh, you're blaming me. It's all my fault. Yeah, it is. It's all my fault. You're supposed to know this stuff. No, I don't. Yeah. You're, Men you're, are supposed to have more cal calories, period, than women as a whole. Although you are five foot seven and a half and I am five foot nine. So, yes, men 
men are different than women and your macros are your individual macros are going to vary so i usually give you more than myself on a whole. Well, what I'm short on in height, I am I excel in stature. There you go. Yes, you do. Okay, you guys. Look at this. This is our breakfast. Eggs and six ounces of ground beef, you guys. It looks and smells absolutely amazing and delicious. What do you think? What do you think? I like Yum. that. Yeah. Okay, I want to take a picture of this and I want to post it on my Facebook. Hey, you guys. Okay. Please join our Facebook group, Loving It on Keto. The link will be in the description below. Please join and give us your recipes, show us some pictures, and help a great group of people with their weight loss journey well, as well. Also on Instagram now, right? I'm on Instagram too. I'm learning Instagram. Anyway, folks, we gotta eat now. So I'll see everybody in the next segment. Okay, you guys, I am stuffed, and I still have some hamburger left, so I'm this was six ounces. I'm going to weigh what I have left. Two ounces. So I ate four ounces basically. Can you see that? I got to make more beef tallow today. Yeah. I think we're on our last beef tallow. These are for those of you that are new. I went to my butcher and I said, hey, what do you do with the steak trimming fat and the beef fat trimmings that you guys do at the bakery? He says, I throw it away. And I said, is there any way I could get it? I talked to Roy, the butcher, and he said, sure, but there's not going to be a whole lot. He goes, and I go, well, when can I come get it? He goes, well, I cut, I'm going to be cutting the um, steaks tomorrow for our sale. And this was a couple weeks back. And he said, why don't you come back at 2 and I'll have it all ready for you. You guys, Roy the Butcher gave me 10 pounds of beef tallow. Did not charge me for it. I would have gladly paid for it. And it's absolutely delicious. So I'll share with uh, you guys when I put it in. I'm going to put it into the air fryer and cook it down so I can get some more delicious tallow for our baking. I mean, for our cooking needs. So... I'll share that with everybody. So I'm going to put this in a separate container, but I basically only ate four ounces of ground beef. It's funny because ground beef is more filling, I think, than a piece of steak as far as the weight. If I had only had four, piece, four ounces of steak and two eggs, I think, or, or only six ounces of steak, I could have eaten the whole thing. Isn't that weird? Maybe not. Well, it could be just today, too. That's you know? true. It could be today. So, anyway, folks, I'm going to put it away, and we'll come back a little bit later. No, the reason why I say that because yesterday you ate. Oh, I ate that huge piece you of steak. That whole, you ate that for and breakfast. And I ate the breakfast, too. Yeah, I yeah you had no problem. I'm just so, just today, you're just right full. now. Yeah. So, yeah. who knows why. Anyway, I'll see everybody in the next segment. Okay, everybody, I have my, um, look at my beautiful tallow. Look at all the fat. Future tallow of America. Yeah. This is the, Look at that. all this delicious beef You're fat. You're going to do it all one time. Right? Yes, I am. Oh, wow. No, it'll be fine. I just need to get a fork so I can move now, it around. Now, I cleaned this like extremely good so because you want the tallow to come out as nice and pretty and white as possible. Yes. If you, try, if you do it in a pan, you get a bunch of burnt stuff and it doesn't work as well. Well, we didn't. We yeah, we did it, but the only reason why I think it works well in the, one of these is air because fire. it's just hot air hitting it. It's not in contact with anything that's super hot. With no heat, we yeah. just got to melt it down. So all you're doing is melting it, like melting a candle. There you go. So I'm going to put this on 15 minutes. It auto, 15 minutes. Hope it doesn't start smoking. And because I want as much of that to render down and then anything that's left you can eat because there's teeny weeny pieces of beef in with that fat that'll shrivel up like a little crackling. You guys ever had pork crackling or chicken, crispy chicken skin crackling? That's what it's going to do. But I need to refill my tallow jar. So yeah, because it's getting a little empty. It's getting real low. I mean, we're down to the nubs here, folks. All the rest of that is inside our tummies. Yes, it is. Anyway, folks, we'll come back when that is done. 
and we'll share everything that we have and everything we get for our beef tallow. The tallow is done. So, I'm going to take out all the pieces. Mm. Ooh, look at this. Now, there's one still, one big gold piece in there, and I'm going to leave it in there, and I'll tell you why in just a second. But let me get all this stuff out. So, see, these pieces still have meat on them. And so, I'm calling it, in my Fitbit, beef suet. Suet is the fat around the kidneys and there's no other way to log it either I would have to say beef suet or beef tallow and it's the same thing it's the beef fat only because we're going to eat some of this oh, yeah. now I'm leaving this piece in here while I pour it oh yeah that's right you got to pour it go ahead and pour this oops ho 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 I salted it, you guys, because I want our tallow to have Redmond's Real Salt in it. So our tallow was rendered, and I salted all the fat really, really good because I want my tallow to have that Redmond's Real Salt taste in it. Right. Maybe beef tallow. Okay, so it's a straight hot out of the air fryer this is why i wash this try to wash this thing really oh, good oh look how pretty that is you guys that is such a beautiful color and then i'm going to cook i'm going to heat your steak up in that leftover steak i try not to pour it too fast because i don't want to you don't want any of the little bunch of pieces crap. of yeah, meat coming yeah the out. junk coming out oh, that's good you can leave what's left to cook the meat in okay Look at that, you guys. That is so darn pretty. Isn't it? Ooh, yeah. Hold up to the sunlight. Yep. Let me see. I got a little stuff in It doesn't matter. It's going to taste delicious. Anyway, put that down because it's hot. You don't want to whack it either because it's in a glass jar. As I've got all this leftover, it was very, very rare still. And it? Harry's more of a medium oh, that's rare. that's stuff, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I don't like it like... She does. She likes it really, really. So I thought while this is hot and it has a little essence of tallow in it, and let me just get this littler piece of steak. I thought there was a little piece of steak. Oh, nope, it's all attached. Is it all attached? Nope, here it is. And see, that's a thinner piece of meat. So I'm gonna put that all together, you guys. And let's get this started. For our dinner, I'm gonna cook five minutes. That's cooking the steak, man. That's cooking the steak. Well, we gotta go get more fat. Yes, I'm gonna have to talk to Roy the butcher next weekend. Mm -hmm. Anyway, you guys, we'll come back when it's dinner and it's steak. Mm -hmm. Gotta get a good piece. They're all delicious. I just want a small one though. That's good. Okay, that seems like a good one. I like them really small. We should cut them up before you put them in there. Well, what do you think? It's heaven, isn't it? Oh my and god. And the Redmond's real salt. It's like a chunky piece of bacon. Yep. It's exactly what it's like. Yep. One more, one more, okay? Well, no, we're made. Put it down. Okay, that one. That that's it, because we're having it as part of our dinner. I'm counting it as suet. You silly boy. Mm. Oh my god. Yes, it's delicious. Yes, this is like dusting. It's so fine. Here we go. This is going in next. Do you need to let it go more? Yes, I do. I know, this is so tempting. Just this dinky winky piece. Just a little dinky, piece, right? Dinky winky piece. Yeah. You guys. <laughs> It's so, it's like beef bacon. It's seriously, because I salt it, and it's got just a teeny bit of like, you know, oh, beef man. in the fat, like a bacon, you know, strip of bacon with the fat, yeah. a little piece of beef on it. It's so dang delicious. Now this, you're gonna call it suet, but it's really not suet, right? right? I mean, it has more meat in it than suet. Suet is pure fat. So you're eating the fat, to lose fat. Yes. 
we were eating too much protein in the beginning right. compared to our fat. Right. Since I've upped the fat and lowered our protein, we've lost weight every day. I know. So it's, it's, some a, it's amazing. Some people do well. It's amazing. On isn't high it? protein and lower fat. Right. We do better the opposite. So which ones do you want on your little thing? The, the smallest of the ones. I like them when they're small because they cook all the way around and they're really good. And the inside gets crispy too a little bit. It gets melting. Okay. So I like it smaller pieces. Okay. Just give me a couple of small ones and I'll take a big one too, you know. I'm not, I'm not proud. A little bit prouder than that. Right? Okay. Yep, that's good. Yeah. And I'll zero that out. Well, what's that come out to? Came out to an ounce. Now I've said I wanted two ounces on mine. All right. And if I took too much, you can take some of it because I, no. that's just the way I am. Yeah. You really want that big piece in oh, there? Yes, I do. I love, yeah. I love fat. So where is it in there? It's right here. Just a minute. Oh, look at there, huh? Because I get two. What the hell that? in. <laughs> there. What is that? Excuse me. Oh, wow. Wait, wait, wait Check while I do out. all this. So we're going to let this rest. I got my two ounces, so I'm going to zero mine out because it was two ounces. Harry gets an ounce because he's having more steak. But so you know, if you look steak. at that, it looks like that's the same almost. Let's see. No, because of the big piece here. Yeah, Excuse me. Yes, you're right. I, I weighed it. Okay. Harry has 11, it's a little over 11 ounces of meat. So he's got 11 ounces of meat and an ounce of his beef suet or the tallow meat. Ready? Mm. Actually, I like this steak. It's 5.61. We'll take another so piece of that. that's what something. I'm gonna try to do. Look at this. Fat to lose the fat. Fat to lose the fat and steak to go with it. Yeah, Protein man. and fat, you guys. Okay, you guys, I'm going to put the other steak in, and I'm going to go ahead and close this vlog out. That steak, I'm going to cook it rare so we have it for tomorrow so that it's all cooked and ready to go for us. If you guys like what you see, please like, subscribe, ring that bell, give us a thumbs up, and we'll see you tomorrow. Good night, everyone. Okay, let me get this big old sucker in.